everybody. So today I'm going to answer all your questions that you sent via Instagram, Facebook, and your comments on YouTube. And with me, I have my Turkish friend, Sami. Bu Sami, he's my Turkish friend, and we have some classes together. So I'm gonna start answering. So one of you guys asked me. I will say the question in French because all of you ask me in French. Je voulais savoir quels sont les étapes que tu as fait pour obtenir une bourse. What are the steps that you did to to get a scholarship? Actually, it's not a step. You work hard in your baccalaureate degree to get at least 14 out of 20, and from that 14 you get scholarship. 14 is a 25% scholarship. The highest you get, the highest the scholarship is. So there is no uh, like steps. Just work hard and get a very high uh, degree in your background. And another one said, uh, Je sollicite en aide pour la procédure d'obtention de bourse auprès des universités en Turquie. Que do qui dois-je contacter directement? Est-ce que l'ambassade? Okay, uh, I think I've. I've started uh, forgetting French but uh, she asked me if she has to um, ask uh, the embassy for uh, for scholarship actually not the um, the embassy you can either contact uh, the university that you want to go into or you go to yes it's um, it's an exam for um, foreigners you go in there there is all the details where it happens uh, the subject the courses everything really like there is nothing that you can miss there uh, another girl asked me uh, is there high schools that I can go in there what I say is no actually you can say in Tunisia high schools in Tunisia are really better than the ones in Turkey our education system until high school are better so stay in Tunisia really uh, another girl asked me the, is there engineering in a zine yes there is engineering industrial engineering mechanical engineering there is all sort of engineering uh, majors Another one asked me uh, for public schools, how much does it cost you for uh, like uh, dormitories, inscription, everything. Well, what I think of, um, it doesn't cost that much. Like for a year, maybe uh, like $2,500. That's the maximum of it for a public school. Uh, and for the pocket money, well, the pocket money it depends. Well, if you're rich, you're gonna spend more. If you're poor, you're gonna spend less. So there is no like fixed thing. But I would say the average is maybe uh, for dollar, a hundred, a hundred dollar is a pocket money. Is it's good, I think. But it's it depends. I mean, if you go to um, nightclubs, to restaurant, to luxury restaurant, it always depends. Another thing: um, does your does Uzin have med faculty? If you have any idea about where to study med school in Turkey for international students, please let me know. No, uh, Uzin doesn't have med school, but there is Bahçeşehir University, there is Acıbadem, there is a lot of universities. What I think you guys should do is just type your major in the internet, plus write Turkey or Istanbul, and search for it, because I can't search for all the majors that you guys want. So write your major, do your search, it's more easy, and you can find all the details in the university website, so it's more easy for you. Okay, so is there a public university for architecture? Yes, there is. There is plenty of it. I think there is Marmar University. There is uh, a lot of universities. Just, just type architecture. Type, I mean, the keywords in Google, and you'll find a lot of things. I mean, I won't do the search for you, but um, you can do it by yourself. Okay. Uh, I have here a pretty long list of questions. Quels sont les meilleures universités publiques en Istanbul? Disons les plus connues. Uh, most famous uh, Istanbul University, well, there is a lot, Boaz University, Istanbul University, Mama University, there is a lot. Uh, quels sont les frais d'inscription du foyer universitaire public? 
I have no idea what are the price of dormitories, public university. I like have no idea. I even didn't search for it. But I don't think it would be that much. It would be pretty cheap. Euh, le minimum d'argent de poche mensuel pour manger et tout, le nécessaire pour vivre quoi. I think I'll say it in Tunisian because I mean I'm from Tunisia and uh, I use Tunisian currency. It would be um maybe in kri ou mekla ou kol shay nitsawer million. Ana khater kiri ab hkayat 500000 fi Tunisia ou 600000 ou ma andek hkayat mekeltek kan omk mich tabatek fi mekla bien sûr. Khrojek, sahabek, transport et tout nitsawer million. C'est pas vraiment le minimum, mais ça a un million de l'espoir. Mais quand je t'en suis voyé, ça peut être moins que ça. Bon. Euh, les meilleures spécialités. Best majors in Turkey. Well, everybody here is like chosen either uh, architecture or mechanical engineering. So, either, I mean, in my faculty, in my uh, university, when I ask someone, Either they have architecture or they have aviation management. Yeah, I think that's it. But there's no like best majors. You can choose whatever you like. You're going to study. You choose what you want to study. Okay. Comment est la vie en Turquie? How is life in Turkey? Life is good depends on what you like. For example, I'm liking life here. Uh, it's better than Tunisia, I think. Yep. There is some bad things in here but it depends on your attitudes it depends on what you like what you don't like so come here and judge it by yourself okay uh, pour la langue est-ce que on doit la voir ou on peut l'apprendre là-bas in turkey turkish language is the key for everything so you'd better learn before you come but you can learn it in here i mean it's not that big of a problem but it will open a lot of doors for you so i mean Especially for girls in Tunisia, you guys watch TV series. TV series makes it a lot easier to learn the language, so it's easy, it's easy. Okay. Quelles sont les langues d'études les plus utilisées? What are the most used language for uh, learning? It's either Turkish or English, and I'm using Turkish for my major, which is business administration. Comment peut-on avoir une bourse? Peut-on travailler en parallèle? Uh, I already explained the scholarship part and can we uh, work in the same time? Internationals? No, unfortunately no, because we're internationals. Uh, it's illegal to work here, but uh, I know some of guys that work here, it's illegal, but I don't know. It depends on you guys. If you want to become illegal and go to jail, well, that depends on you. <laughs> yeah. So, um, If you have more questions, I, I would uh, prefer to answer in private message because right now the video is eight minutes long and it's too long. I hope you don't get bored. The next video would be in Tunisian Arabic because my friends requested to be in Tunisian. And I will say, next video, we some tricks. How do you do it? You have a lot of money in the back. And a lot of money at 14-15. So, we will say, what do I do in the back? شنو هما الحاجات اللي استعملتهم اللي ان شاء الله انتم مازالت تاخذوا ماين بيها في الباك وابيانتو سي يو جايز